I can feel it. Hmm. Sure you close up. Let me explain. This is it.
Excuse me. Are you headed home too? Same here. That reminds me. Thank you. Why don't we find a seat somewhere? Huh? And you are... It's been quite a while, Akechi-san. And the same for you. Yoshizawa-san, right? My father works at a TV station. Have you ever seen Good Morning Japan? My father's the director. I've been brought onto the show as a guest a number of times now. That's how I ended up becoming acquainted with Yoshizawa-san. I didn't know you knew her as well. He helped me out of a jam before, and now he's been offering me guidance. Helped you out of a jam, huh? I see. So, what were you two up to? Oh, right! I was just about to share some exciting news. It's nothing to keep secret, so I may as well spill it now. About that summer competition I mentioned to you before, I was chosen to be our club representative. This only feels like the beginning to me, though. Isn't your club's team considered to be quite prestigious? And you're their representative. I must say, that's extremely impressive. Thank you. I'll do my best to make everyone proud. I'll be cheering you on as well. Ha, ah, I have an idea. Since all three of us are here, why don't we go somewhere as a group? We can call it our little celebration for Yoshizawa-san's success. That would be wonderful. Does that work for you, Senpai? That settles it. Would you mind if I chose the place? There's a wonderful little cafe I know about. Of course. Lead the way. Yoshizawa-san? You drink hot beverages even in the summer? I have to prevent my body from getting too cold, since the meat's coming up rather soon. I see. You make sure you're covering all your bases. Good point. Well, some people say coffee can cool you off, even when hot, so I try to avoid that, too. I had this image that you enjoy sweet things, Akechi-san. Is that untrue? I swear I saw you eating fried sweet bread on TV just the other day. It's all part of a marketing strategy. That sort of stunt is an easy crowd pleaser. You seem to have your own bases covered as well. Presenting oneself in a favorable light is nothing surprising. More surprising is just how innocent you seem to be. I've been wondering, how do you two know each other? His social studies class visited the set of a TV show I appeared on. Ah, that's right. Second years got to go to a TV station. He and I exchanged our opinions during the shoot, and his way of thinking intrigued me. I can definitely see that. Senpai's take on things often helps me as well. That reminds me, Yoshizawa-san. You had mentioned that he's...
This is it. All right.
one's here.
Exams are fun. Uh, I can get back to action. Hmm. You must have been studying pretty hard if it kept you up at night. Nah, I was up playing video games. Slacking off is just too much fun. I know, right? I kept cleaning my room instead of studying. I might even be too clean now. You two are perfect exemplars of what escapism can mean. <sighs> and I can only... Whatever! What's real important is the fa... Kinda feels like... I've even heard people... There's no need... Hold up! I hope you guys didn't forget. I guess we're good meeting up in Shibuya, yeah? We sure are on top of these kinds of... What's up? So that's it? It barely even started? We seem to be prima- I guess this is what people call- Jumping the gun. Eh, there ain't nothing to do here. You wanna go grab a bite somewhere? Sorry, I'm considering picking up more art supplies. I have a summer assignment to work on. Also, the summer festival drained my coffers. Even if I did grab a bite, all I could order would be water and a hot towel. Ah. Uh... Well, in that case, probably ought to just call it quits for today. Hmm? Hey, isn't that Yoshi's... Don't you think she's acting strange? You know, she... Uh... Huh? Yes. Senpai? Yes. Uh, did you come to see the stadium, too? Same here. I needed to give myself a pep talk. Sometimes, when things get me down, I come here. Although, that doesn't really answer your question, does it? I know this may get in the way of your plans, but would you be willing to join me for lunch? Whew, that was delicious! always like this after a meet. 
In all honesty, I'd like to keep going, but any more will end up harming my performance. Simply put, it was a disaster. I've been feeling like I'm getting back into the natural flow of things, thanks to you, Senpai. But when the moment of truth arrived, my body still wouldn't move the way that I wanted it to. I think that's a big factor. Something similar happened to me in middle school, but back then... I have a younger sister. We promised each other that we'd win international gymnastics competitions together. But this spring, she died in an accident. I promised her we'd take the gold for our routines across the world. But I can't stop worrying about my lack of improvement lately. I've really been throwing myself into practice. But I wonder if even that won't be enough. Senpai, thank you for being so thoughtful. You just keep on rescuing me, don't you? Okay, no more brooding. There are still more meets left this year. I'm going to start from scratch and train as hard as I can. Thank you so much for listening to all that. Now I feel like I've been recharged, mind, body, and spirit. <laughs> At least my mind and spirit are recharged. The best way to stave off hunger is with some vigorous activity. I'm going to jog home. Take care. Ah, you're back. What did you say?
The holiday. Wait, so... Ugh. So hot. I feel like I'm being baked. Like you need help? Then yeah. why don't you go buy me a towel already, huh? Yeah, <laughs> we're just trying to get out of the rain. I guess everyone. What's up? Hmm. I think I just saw someone I know. You mean the girl in that black car? Well, she's got a ride. Oh, time to show your skills, Mona. We need you as a car. It's not possible in the real world. My feet hurt. It's cold. The festival's been canceled. This sucks. We made such a commotion with the public, and this is what we get? Aren't heroes that lurk in the shadows boring? So that's what... So you won't tell me, no matter what. I have nothing more... The cause behind these are the details of the message.
were busy. Hey, it's not my... I know summer vacation is due to begin next week, but I have an unfortunate announcement. We'll be holding an emergency assembly on Monday the 25th. Settle down. We've had many strange... Hence, Principal Kobaya... Well, this is inconvenient. Unable. Turns out there's no use for a rule-abiding honor student when things... Now that I'm a member of this team, I... all my studying up to this point is... I think... I... I... Advisor? My first step will be... I... I knew it. I don't even know where people like to go for fun. It would be nice to have a... Plus, the student council must be responsible for understanding the student body they serve, right? I don't mean that in a surveillance way. I just want to know them as people. I may be a phantom thief, but that's no excuse for me to start ignoring my presidential duties. Now, back to the topic at hand. Where do people usually go for fun? My friends, if possible, I'd like to go somewhere. How about an arcade? I've never actually been to one. Do you think you could... T I'm not sure if it'll broaden my horizons, per se, but simply studying won't get me anywhere. Thank goodness. Well... This is where everyone comes to enjoy themselves. There are more girls here than I expected. Hey, over there! You play by aiming the gun at the screen, right? That actually seems somewhat realistic. Hmm. I if it's okay with you, do you think you could teach me? I did it! Huh? No way! Ah! Oh, so this is how... Of course, that was just a game, but... I wonder if I could apply some of the techniques I learned here during battle. Perhaps 
going somewhere I don't normally frequent is what helped me come up with that idea. You know, it may only be a little bit, but I think I'm starting to understand how people pass time. Interesting. I would have never even thought about coming here before. I... Hey... Do you think I might be able to give the team more ideas if I can gain increased knowledge outside of my studies? I need to live up to your expectations now that I've taken up your time. Perhaps it won't be immediately, but I'm sure I can be of use. I didn't think magic be influent. I wonder what the entertain a luxury for the so that hey, your phone was buzzing. Around.
Oh. <laughs> Good evening. We were thinking about putting together plans. Hmm. It's nice to meet you. My name is Makoto Nijima. I hope we're not being a bother. She's our student council president. Nijima. Is something wrong? No, it's nothing. A student council president, eh? <laughs> I'm stunned. I hope he's not causing you too much trouble, Sakura. But everyone just calls me boss. By the way, that was addressed to you. Uh, this old man will get going and leave you kids be. All right, the store's all yours. We have late-breaking news on Medjit, whose notoriety rose since their statement the other day. Just moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. again. In any case... We're gonna get reported if we... What do you know about? <sighs> it's got nothing to do with it. I'm going home. Looks like it's a hit.
Yo, tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but... <sighs> Up until now, the chief buys a lot of food. Far more than enough for one person living alone. Let's check out all the shops where you can buy... Taba? I haven't heard any. Come again. Hmm. I think our only option now is to... <sighs> you read the letter, did you not? So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba. You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Waka... Tipped off? What are you talking... Back to the matter at hand. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it you're okay with that outcome? What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. With, with these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it! We're extreme. As long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. Fine. You win. Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. And stay out! That woman is... What? This doesn't involve you. That's enough. Just behave yourself. Keep going to school if you don't want me to throw you out of here. You got... 
Lock the store up. Well, that basically confirms Futaba exists, at least. But it sounds like she's got her own problems. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? I wonder what the chief's hiding. We can't really press him on the subject, though, especially after he mentioned throwing you out. A woman was threatening Bach? The flounder is out of this world. Mm. That texture. Uh, I don't see any prices listed here. It's called market price. Don't worry about it. We got the cash. So good. Hey, is the fatty tuna ready yet? Hold your horses. 
And don't talk! By the way, is Boss really the kind of person who would abuse someone? That again? I can't get it off my mind. Especially if it means he could be taken to court. What kind of person is he? Do you truly believe he'd do such a thing? Hmm... If it's really true about the abuse, he'd be a no-good jerk pretending to be a guardian. Maybe the chief is the one who needs a change of heart. Hold on a sec. About that. I actually got curious after our conversation, and checked his name in the nav. Sounds to me like there wasn't a hit. Right. Anything beyond this is his family's problem. We probably shouldn't get any more involved. Wait! You think Alibaba could be Boss's ex-wife? He must have cheated on her, and that's where Futaba came from! Doubtful. Your imagination has run rampant. How foolish. Mm. Still, this is delicious. I've never experienced anything quite like it before. Man, and it's all thanks to us being the Phantom Thieves. It... Crap! Uh, um, f f fan fantastic This sushi is delicious! Y yeah The fish is so fresh! Hm. Everywhere we go, we hear about these Phantom Thieves. What rubbish. Think about where we are, Ryuji. Sorry, it just kind of slipped. My apologies for bringing up Boss again. We should just enjoy the food. Ijima-san, what are you doing here? Akechi-kun. Akechi? You're the ones from the TV station. Could it be that you're friends of Nijima-san? Do you know this guy? It's nice to meet you. My name is Akechi. Glad to make your acquaintance, Yusuke Kitagawa. How do you know my name? Well, because I'm a psychic, of course. <laughs> I'm only joking. In truth, I'm a rookie detective. You're a former pupil of Madarame, right? I have actually just recently joined the investigation team looking into the Phantom Thieves. Did you see that Mejed has declared war on them? War? Their website was updated just a moment ago. For real? Ah, English again! Wait, what? What's it say? Huh. Why do you seem so agitated? Oh, um... She's, uh, a huge fan of the Phantom Thieves. A total nut job for him. Hmm. I don't know how wise it is to be a fan of groups like them. What is with these comments? My apologies. I didn't mean to butt into your conversation. But I must say, this is an interesting group. Prosecutor Nijima's sister, an ex-pupil of Madarame, and a few Shujin Academy students. It seems you're all connected to the Phantom Thieves. Perhaps you have better intel than I do. Ah, yes. I wanted to ask you something. Regarding this whole Mejed commotion, if you were one of the Phantom Thieves, what would you do? Hmm. So you share the majority's opinion. Sorry to disappoint, but we're just normal high school kids. If anything, we want to hear what you gotta say, Mr. Detective. My profiling of the Phantom Thieves has led me to believe they are a group of juveniles. They have a relative amount of free time after school and a hideout to slip away to. Furthermore, considering Kamashita was their first target, it seems they began activity around April. In a way, all I've just said about the Phantom Thieves coincides with the group you have here. What? You gonna report us? I didn't say I was being suspicious of you. <laughs> 
seems you're not perturbed in the slightest. You really are an intriguing one. I lack your calm mannerisms, but don't you think my deduction is an interesting one? I bet we'd make a great team if we worked together. <laughs> what? The hell are you saying? Well, this has been a valuable point of reference for me. I hope to see you all again. What was that about? Do you think he's ascertained our true identities? Nah, couldn't be. Right? I'd like to say that it's simply us overthinking this, but... It may be best to be cautious from now on. We shouldn't forget that Alibaba was able to discover who we are. True, but it's not as though he had tangible evidence to prove that discovery. Just keep acting normally. More importantly, things are getting serious with Medjet. Oh yeah! What did they write? Here, I'll read it. We are disappointed in the people of Japan and their belief in the Phantom Thieves' false justice. Hence, we shall proceed with our plan to cleanse Japan. This process will commence on August 21st. As a result, the Japanese economy shall suffer devastating damages. For real? Keep going. However, we are magnanimous. We will give the Phantom Thieves one final opportunity to repent. As proof of this repentance, we demand that they reveal their identities to the public. We will attack if these demands remain unmet. The future of Japan rests with the Phantom Thieves. We are Majed, we are unseen, we will eliminate evil. That's what it says. Mm, sounds bad. In other words, if we don't unmask ourselves, Majed will attack Japan, correct? It seems they are quite the attention seekers. What are we gonna do about this? If only we could get in contact with Alibaba. Our only clues are Boss and Futaba. Anyways, it's too damn hot out here. Why don't we go to Leblanc? We can talk more over there. We went through all sorts of options on our way here, but... Looks like we got no choice but to ask for Alibaba's help. Question is, how do we get in touch with him? He cut off all contact with us after that misunderstanding. Then again... Nobody's but the light think she's now even I would think oh. Hello sir He's not out is he I hope he didn't pass out or something. I mean boss is kind of old ain't he? I'm a bit worried. Should we go in and check on him? Please excuse us. <laughs> Scream? How should... Did you hear that? Let's get out of here! What are you freaking out? Uh, I'm... Could it be Alibaba? I mean, Futaba? Sorry, um, can I hold your hand? I can sense someone's presence. Who is it? Who's there? I can't take this anymore, I'm leaving! No, no, my legs won't move.
Who the hell are you? Did you hear me? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, sis. Somebody please save me. You? What are you doing in my house? Uh... You're... Oh, uh, good... Good evening, sir. Uh, we... Uh, we didn't mean to intrude. Nijima-san? Wait, are, are you two dating? W we're just friends. Friends nowadays get that close to each other? Uh, that's not it. This... Um... Uh, things happened and... You kids are here too? Um, we brought you some sushi, but nobody answered when we rang the bell. The door was unlocked, too. We could hear the TV, though, so we got worried he might have passed out or something. The door was unlocked? Yes. <sighs> I do that sometimes. Guess I'm getting old. Um, excuse me. There's something we'd like to ask. Hmm? You want to ask me? There's someone else living here, isn't there? Yeah, my daughter. Could she be Futaba Sakura? You told Nijima-san too? Uh, um, is there any way we could meet with Futaba-san? I think we may have frightened her earlier, so we'd like to apologize if at all possible. Well, uh, that's... Is she sick? No, no, it's not like that. <sighs> Don't want you all getting the wrong idea. <sighs> I shouldn't have kept this a secret from you. Let's talk at my shop. She'll hear us if we stay here. Now... Where do I start? Futaba's mother and I knew each other long before Futaba was born. Her mother was a bit of a weird one, but we got along well for some reason. She was sharp-witted, somewhat stern, a little socially inept, but always carefree. She truly was a great woman. I see. When something piqued her interest, that'd be all she focused on. She always worked deep into the night. There wasn't a father. Do you mean... Well, there probably was one. I didn't know him, though. She... No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. Hold on a sec. Do we even know if she has a palace? Let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that gonna be enough? What the...? She's got one! So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana...
Were you just going to go to sleep without even wondering where I was? I take it the Chief told you about Futaba, and then you guys disbanded in relief for now? Hmm. You can't underestimate my intel gathering skills, you know. I was checking out the Chief's house. I didn't think our Alibaba would be so young. Well, she's probably about the same age as you guys. At least her voice was pretty young sounding. Oh, and she had long hair too. At the very least, she's surely no amateur. She completely overheard your conversation with the Chief. And she can hack into our chats too. Even if she can't take Medjed down directly, she might have some kind of lead on them. In any case, we'll need to rely on Futaba to get closer to Medjet. Well, let's meet up again tomorrow. How about we do it in here? It's way too hot outside. Anyway, make sure you let everyone know. Futaba Sakura? She had one of these palaces? Hold on. While Medjid was targeting you, you chose to deal with someone completely unrelated to them? Then how was Medjid... What you said about the Sakura family generally falls in line with our investigation. It appears you aren't feeding us a false testimony. If you're lucid enough for jabs, you can get back to your story. It's still unclear to us as to how the Phantom Thieves dealt with Medjed since their identity is unknown. If you tell me something coherent, I may be a little more willing to believe you. All right. Still, to think the Phantom Thieves would have their hideout in the home of Wakaba Ishiki's daughter. <laughs> what a coincidence. No. Perhaps it's fate. Regardless, we don't have time to waste. Continue with your story. And that assembly had me bored to tears. Huh? Did you... I'm doing laundry, so these are the only clothes I had to wear. So we just gotta figure out what she, if she can't get out, maybe a prison? Conditions have not been met. Perhaps a labyrinth with an unknown exit. Conditions have not been met. Hmm. Maybe an oasis? Conditions have not been met. Nothing so far. In that case, how about hell? Conditions have not been met. Uh, we don't have nearly a if only we can. But what will we say to What do you mean? You have to be joking. Won't the door be locked for sure this time? I'll take care of that. Oh, and I figured out where Futaba's room was when I snuck in last night. 
What if we run into Bot? He's at work now, so I think we should be fine. Oh. Getting cold feet, Makoto? Don't worry, it'll be nothing. We've gone through loads of shit like this already. This is our only choice, right? I perhaps she'll at least... Very well. Let's do this. There's no answer. Futaba-chan, are you there? I'm sorry for being... No reaction whatsoever. Ah, this is gonna be hard. You're listening. Is it Alibaba? Why is she only... You're Futaba Sakura. She's not respond. Does she not like us? We don't have time to dally around. We need her key. We want to learn more about you. If we don't do so, we can't steal your heart. The reason why we came here is because we need the keyword to enter your palace. That's why we want to talk with Futaba Sakura herself, and not Alibaba. You don't have to show yourself, just answer some questions for us. Chat messages are fine. All right then. Our leader, the guy who lives in LeBlanc's attic, wants to speak. We're counting on you. Forgotten your promise of helping us if we complete your request, right? Well, then, let's hurry up and go. And clicky. You idiot! Don't activate it here! Desert. Yeah, we... Wait, what the... Futaba herself is asking us to steal her heart. It'd be odd if she saw us as a threat. If she doesn't see us as an enemy, then your clothes don't change. That's how it works. But more importantly, I told you to be cautious. Why'd you activate it like that? Is that why we ended up in a desert? Where's the tomb? Oh, it's so damn hot here. Even though we entered right in front of her room, we didn't end up inside it. She must really want to keep people away from her. Mm, I see. What a bleak feeling this place has. It's the complete opposite of Kanashiro's bank. Let's hurry up and get going. Where's the palace? Is it that way? Oh yeah, there's something shiny tomb in the desert. I see. Anyway, let's make our way there. Isn't that kind of far? Are we gonna walk? Of course not. My paws will get burned. I've been waiting for this. I'll make sure to put the AC on full blast. You're so considerate. <laughs> right. All right. Let's roll!
Um, can I have a drink? Didn't you have mineral water? I drank it already. <sighs> How are the guys? working at all that was the best I could do so for real what was that Jeez, shut up it to think her hey uh... yes it's a... that's how it's mostly known for instance reviving it's hey god I'm gonna melt Focus. Oh, yeah, you've seen her. It's 
something to help me! Damn it! What the hell? Oh, this is bad. I'm having a hard time getting a grasp of our situation. What now? Date that Medjid is the Phantom th will Medjid in order to.
we go? Thank you very much. All right. this Yeah. Oh. You. You got time right now? Next time then.
Hey. Hi. <laughs> hmm. Oh. Is this... Let us part ways here.
There's still... It's so wet out. All right. Man, 
it's hot. Hey! better have the money. Sometimes they even reach the millions. D
All right.
You want us to steal your- Hmm. Why don't we make a- A deal? There is a town nearby. I would like- Oh yeah! I- If you bring what was stolen back to me... Can't you tell us any more de- You'll learn all the info- We'll need to head outside if we want- Yes. What do you want to do? Persona! Take this! 
tenacious. It's trying to run. Watch out. Think it's got your gang. This is my other self. <laughs> we can't let it escape now. Take it out. Come. You're mine. Persona! Go down! Not moving much. Do it! According to plan. Mm. Nice work, team. All right. Huh. That I was an something. easy battle. Show me your true form! Not moving must do it. Okay, guys. Dip into your underground group. Throw the scent of prior notice. Call for you. We want to Alright, you don't want to skip. Give it up. Wipe it out. This will I leveled up. Okay. <laughs> Child's play. <laughs> what? Wait! Is well, Still 
not that moving muscle. Do it. According to plan. A spectacular victory! Okay. That was an easy win. Let's go, Joker. Yes. Try this skill soon. There is an alarm in effect. Today we will hang them more forcefully. Shoot for the stars! Is this 
the power you wish to receive? It seems you are making good use of the alarm. executed. Neither remarkable nor unremarkable. Choose which skills to inherit. This gift of power. Well, well. Remarkable. You okay with this? It is neither remarkable nor unremarkable. You okay with this? Choose which skills to inherit. to inherit.
Expect a modest gift of power. <laughs> I see. Well now, a most unexpected turn of events. Certain movements. Do it. Okay, guys. your true form.
Show me your true form. identified awaiting joker's orders i'll reveal oh, your oh, true oh. form all right the first move is first on. Up. we're evenly matched here just don't let your guard down persona persona still fight come
Show me your true form! Strong shadow ahead. We should be careful. There's a treasure chest. Come, let's open it. Show me your true form. too forceful. that, are you? Strong looking shadow. Stay focused. Hey. This 
This is my other self. Die! Yeah. Persona! <laughs> <laughs>